NASDAQ ENDING DOWN MORE THAN 2%. WE'VE GOT YOU COVERED ON ALL OF THESE NEW DEVELOPMENTS. LET'S FIRST GO TO NICOLE PEDALINI. SHE'S ON THE FLOOR OF THE NEW YORK STOCK EXCHANGE FOR MORE ON TODAY'S BIG SELL-OFF. AND NICOLE, WHAT ARE THE TRADERS SAYING? I CAN ONLY IMAGINE. ARE THEY BRACING FOR IMPACT? Listen, I mean, they're used to the trading. That's what the market's about. The VIX, the fear index, jumps 30%. As you noted, Melissa, we are right now down 722 points. This is a big day of selling. They're probably going to be happy that we at least held that February low that we closed at 23,860. We're up at 23,960. So that'll be interesting to see if they see that as a level of support. Interestingly enough, so often when we have these big sell-offs, they buy them back. I think they're going to watch to see now that we've broken down below some really key technical levels, whether they'll start to buy them back or if it means lower lows. That being said, let's take a look. We know that tariffs and trade wars have been front and center. Boeing, Caterpillar, 3M have been under pressure. We've seen some of these names, for example, Caterpillar down 6% this week. The financials, as we have a rising rate environment, that spooks people. People as well. These financials, though, which usually can move up with the rising rate environment, all to the downside. Wells Fargo, Bank of America down 4% each. Facebook, the entire Facebook story has. Uh, Everybody on Wall Street talking about it. I asked one of the traders, I went in there, and we talked about all different things, and he said they don't like to see a lot of change in the White House, which is what we've been seeing a little bit of. They believe in Trump. They believe in his administration, but they don't want to see a lot of changes. Like we had the lead lawyer stepping down today and resigning, and this Facebook story about social media and regulation and working with the government, this whole story, this is down about 11% this week for Facebook. It is down 450 today at 164.89, and that really took tech down across the board so much so that uh, we did see the Nasdaq for the week down about four percent this week back to you yeah you do get the sense that Facebook is in real trouble and that is definitely uh, a drag on things Nicole thank you so much